Hi folks, and welcome back to Math with Captain Ron, making this video to uh, help you out with uh, factoring some of these a uh, little bit stranger looking uh, deals that are uh, the sum of or difference of two cubes. So first of all, you have to know these, uh, these formulas for factoring the sum or difference of two cubes, right? And now the idea here is, you know, looking at this first one, we want to be able to write it as like something cubed plus something cubed. And the million dollar question, how do we do that? Well, if we look right here, this x to the 3n, and we remember that you know, multiplication is commutative. So we could write it like this, x to the n times 3. And over here, hopefully we recognize 8 can be written as 2 to the third power. So we have two algebra steps there. Okay, now when we take a look at this, x to the n to the, uh, times 3, that's equal to x to the n cubed plus 2 to the third, okay? Because remember, when you raise a power to a power, you multiply our exponent. So now what we have to do is realize, okay, when we look at this formula here, a is equal to x to the n, and b is equal to 2. And then we just put these values in. So this is going to factor into, right, the a plus b term is going to be x to the n plus 2. And then a squared is going to be x to the n squared, and you could write that x to the 2n, minus ab, I'm going to write the b first if you don't mind, b times a plus b squared, which would be 4, right, because remember it's minus 2. And that's good enough for that particular problem. Take a look at this one. So again, what we want to do is kind of write it like this first. So let's take this and how about when you write it um, 2n times 3? And then what I'm doing is kind of separating off 3, much like I did over here, right? It's similar to that step. Plus, in the second term, we can write this as y to the third times 3, right? So these are equivalent. And now we just recognize what we're looking at. This is x to the 2n cubed and y cubed cubed. <laughs> so here are a, if you will, is x to the 2n, and our b is y cubed. And you don't have to write this out, but I, I do suggest you do so if you're having trouble factoring this thing. So now we're just going to, again, apply our uh, formula here for factoring the sum of two cubes. So the first term is a plus b, x to the 2n plus y to the third times squared. So I can take this and re-square it. It's going to be x to the 4n. Because remember, when you raise a power to a power, you multiply exponents. Minus, and again this term, a times b. So it'll be minus x to the 2n, y to the third. Then the last term plus b squared. So if we take this and re-square it, so there's a couple examples of factoring uh, the sum of two cubes. The difference of two cubes works the same. You just have subtle differences in the signs here and uh, here. But other than that, they're done exactly the same. So I hope that this video helps. Have a great day.